You can see it in everyone's eyes. They all want this championship. Plenty has been said about Andre's physical attributes, but I'd also like to call out his ferocious determination inside the ring. That's a great point, Cole. Andre's incredible stature didn't automatically earn him a nearly 15-year-long undefeated streak. He fought hard to make that jaw-dropping stat a reality. Just another reason he's one of the most intimidating competitors that WWE has ever seen. I'm sure he's as committed to winning as ever in this match here tonight. Then you have a man like Jake the Snake Roberts. Absolutely brutal and menacing, while also being captivating and enthralling. Yeah, for whatever reason, it's simply hard to look away when Jake is inflicting pain on his opponents. From the top! Nobody hold on there. Counter with Roberts. Each superstar trying to stay a step ahead. He turns it around. Just incredible power. Now look at his aggression, just pure brutality. Not easy. Andre gets fended off. Oh, gonna take all the breath out of the body. Jake Roberts is such an intimidating superstar, one who can inflict just as much damage mentally as he does physically. How do you even counteract that? The answer is to focus. Don't let Roberts get into your head, and instead just focus on the match at hand. He can't beat you at his game if you're not playing it. Whatever's playing here can't be good. Targeting the throat there. Oh, saw it coming. Well, oh, hold on. Is he thinking of the submission here? And the low save it there. But will he be able to last much longer? Oh, oh, God. He turns it around. And responds with a counter of their own. Bang it back with their own counter. With the reversal. A counter answered by another counter. Using your noggin. Catches the kick. And Andre expected that. Kick to the gut. Get him into the corner. Things went from bad to worse. Rips the pride. And the slam. Well, this is pretty cocky. <laughs> in time. Are you kidding me? Oh. He has him right where he wants him. Oh, running FTO plants him. Nicely done. And we see him take yet another shot to the body. Look at that insult to injury with that one. Jake just getting knocked around. And as you can see, he's not playing Jake's games and putting his focus on the match at hand. We might be close to the end. He needs to give himself some room to regroup fast. Roberts proving there just how captivating it can be to inflict pain. Caught the leg. An elusive giant there. Shoulder tackle. Just malicious, insulting. Oh, this is bad, guys. Jake Roberts is bleeding. Now's the time to find that second win. Sky high. Splash! And Jake with a counter. Yeah. 
Andre gets reversed. And that could be a first step towards Jake gaining control. This could be a good chance for Jake to get some distance and rethink his approach. And his torch. Incredible to think, after everything we've witnessed, we are still at a stalemate. And the heaviest hitter in the arsenal was not enough. <laughs> Look at this crowd! It's insanity in here, Bedlam! And the beating his body has taken has led him into this very dangerous situation. And bit by bit, he was broken down. Now he's practically a sitting duck. These two showing how well Scott and Nate each other. Andre!